Hey everybody, it's Jen with Two Sister Bees. Welcome to the channel. Today is Savings Challenges Day and it is gonna be hype. We have so much stuff going on for you guys. We've got our savings challenges for every budget. We have a new Two Sister Bees game for you guys. I have received some of the prizes for the 10K giveaway and we're gonna open this up together. And of course, our Hello Honey game this week is entitled, You Are Trippin'. Okay, so now I'm wondering, are you hype? Let's go. We have some big stuff going on in every part of this video, and we're gonna start with, with this one. As always, our no budgeters will be stuffing five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. These are our no budgeter games, and all three of these are freebies. They are linked below for you guys to click and print so you can start playing today. So let's start with, triple play monthly challenge and we're going to move down here to august and we're going to do the date today which is the 11th we're going to take the two ones add them together and save two dollars and next is the exciting one 100 honeys because we are going to be finishing this out today with our eight dollars we're going to color in these honey pots and we will have 100 dollars that is going into our emergent bee fund i'm so excited to color off 10 honeycombs today you guys 10. let's put the eight dollars to the side and color our eight honey pots yay there it is let's take a moment and check out our hard work. I know, believe me, when you start a new savings challenge and you're just coloring in those first few symbols and you look at all the rest, you just think to yourself, oh my gosh, I'm never gonna fill this out. But look, it happens. We do. And we did this with $10 a week. <sighs> Let's get this money so we can put it in the Emerging Bee Fund. Okay, so Triple Play is getting the two, and it is now up to 20, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. That's pretty awesome. I didn't realize Triple Play was up to $40 already. And 100 honeys. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this. Let's add the eight. And we all know what we have here. 50, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100 dollars. Yes, let's get it into the emerging bee. which has 50, so we have a total of 150 in our Emerging Bee Fund. And I have said this many, 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 many times before on the channel. Most Americans cannot handle a $400 emergency. If something that cost $400 happened, they would go into utter chaos. You guys already have 150 plus the 40 in triple play, which means you are halfway to your $400. Time to color these in. And guess who else gets to color in some of their Emergent Bee today? Yep, you guessed it, Low Budgeters. Let's see what we've got today. Low budgeters have 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. The first thing we have to do with the low budgeters cash is pay up on save or spend. Last week we went a little overboard with our dice and we owe spend $9. Next, we're gonna do What's the Buzz? This is based off of our daily weather. Today, the high is 92 degrees. So we are gonna add the nine and the two together 
for 11. And this last $30 over here is going to go to Lotus and Lily, 10, 20, $30. There you have it, you guys. Another completed game, Lotus and Lily. Love seeing this. Let's get this cash put away so we can add to our emergency fund. What's the buzz gets 11. And it is now up to 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 101. Okay, let's see how much we saved up with Lotus and Lily. And this 80 cents has been hanging out. I'm gonna add 20 cents to this to make an even dollar. So we now have a total of 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 155, 160, 61, 62, 63, 64, and that dollar, 165 going into our Emergent B Fund. Okay, so at $10 a piece, we are gonna be coloring 16 and a half of these honeycombs. Okay, that was pretty satisfying. I got to color in that whole section up there and a few of these down here, 16 and a half honeycombs, all colored in. For a total of one, two, three, four, five, six, 720, 40, 60, 65, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, seven, 75, almost to that thousand. Okay, everybody, super exciting. We got to add money to both Emergent B funds. Oh my goodness. What's going on with the Woe Budgeters today? 20, 40, 60, 81, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, and 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 60, 9. 269 is correct. We played five games so far, so we are going to pull five Busy B cards. One, two, three, four, five. Forgot to get my envelope out. Let's see. Wildflower, this is any amount you wish. Let's go with a dollar. One. Buzzworthy, save based on the genre of the last thing you watched. I actually was watching YouTube, five bucks. Honey Money is easy, three dollars. Be on time. Save based on the current hour. Ugh, I really have no idea what time it is. I think it's 9 a.m. I'm pretty sure. So we'll go with 9. Nine. And the last one is be spending. What was the last thing I bought? Hmm. I have not been buying anything. I would say food. I went grocery shopping a few days ago. That is $1. Let's cash in these ones. One, two, three, four, five. A 10. So, so far we've got 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 going into Busy Bee cards. 
Okay, let's talk about this 10K giveaway, you guys. Okay, so 10K is definitely a big one, and I've already started shopping for little items for you guys. So let's see what we've got here. I think you guys might like this one. Oh my goodness, what do we have here? This looks familiar. I have not opened this yet. Okay, so at least once a week, <laughs> every time I do a savings challenge video, somebody asks, where did you get that bee binder? Well, here they are, and we will be having three winners on the 10K giveaway, so I figured it would be really cool to give each one a bee binder from Two Sister Bees. So here's that. I'm going to put the link below, the Etsy link, in case you want one. They actually come in other colors as well. I just lean towards the yellow. And the Etsy seller also sent some freebies because I told them that it was part of a YouTube giveaway. So let's see what they were nice enough to add. Oh my gosh, they added, I'm assuming one's for me since there's four, and we will go ahead and open the fourth one. This is so nice. So again, this will be for our one, two, and three winners. Okay, we've got a bank bag, which I love the clear. This is so nice. And we've got a laminated teller slip. Thank you. And a really nice prop money $1,000 placeholder. Super nice. And a B keychain. Thank you so much. This was so nice of you to add to our 10k giveaway for our subbies you did not have to do that and it is so appreciated so this is part of the 10k giveaway and you guys i did a thing i have never done this before but i did it for the 10k giveaway i made savings challenges i did this myself i was so proud of myself i did this one, which is just called 10K. I'm not as fancy with the names as my sister is, but each symbol is worth $10. And once you complete, you check it off here, that will be $1,000. If you want to go all the way up to 10,000, you can by doing this 10 times. You could do up to 5,000, you could do up to 2,000, whatever you want to do. <sighs> what do you guys think of my first savings challenge? So proud of myself. This will be a freebie for everyone, by the way, once we hit the 10K. And I made a no spend challenge. This could be used any month of the year. I just made sure that there was 31 honeycombs to color in. And down here at the bottom, wealth consists not in having great possessions, but in having few wants. And that is such a good reminder when you're trying to do a no spend challenge, because we all know how difficult they are. So these will be part of the 10K giveaway as well. But again, these are freebies for everybody. And there's more, but it's a surprise and I will show you the rest of the prizes in a separate video once we get closer to the 10K. So let's play some savings challenges. Get into my bee binder. I had to give you guys one of these bee binders. I love it and the quality is so good. These stickers have stayed on so nicely and as you guys know, I use this every weekend and I just love it. So, and I know you guys love it too because somebody always asks, so. I had to give one. Okay, save 10 journey. As you can see, I'm up to the 50s. Hmm, I don't have any 50s. So we're gonna have to skip save 10 journey today. Sunken treasure. Okay, let's go ahead and play this one. Okay, this one, you roll your dice and I have a three, which means I will be saving dollars. And let's go with nine. I think we're gonna go ahead and complete Sunken Treasure today. Okay, six is $5 bills. So let's go with the two. 
for 10. And we're gonna go two more times. We're gonna get that one and that 11 checked off. Okay, so one is quarters, which we're gonna check that 11 off with the quarters and it is 275, but I'm gonna round up to three. And let's go for that one. And that is a three, so it is worth $1. Oh my gosh, you guys. Another completed game, yay. And you know what this means? It means I have a completed savings challenge. And when I complete any savings challenge, my money goes to, oh, so exciting, my credit and debt. I know it's not as exciting as the Emergent B Fund. And just so you guys know, April did restock the Etsy store with these, the Save 10 Journey, and some more of these. And believe me, guys, she is over there working, working, working. She has got some new scratch-offs coming up for you guys. One's for fall and Halloween. I can't wait to see the Halloween ones. I'm excited about that. So, Sunken Treasure. Let's see how much is going to add today. 50, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 115. Added to the 650. We're up to 765 that I am going to be able to make a payment this week. And so I don't forget, I'm gonna put a busy B card over here since we played a game. And let's go ahead and see what we need here for Strawberry Picnic. And this game comes with this cute little pouch that has these little tiles in there that you pull out of the bag and mark off the corresponding strawberry or bear. But I am down to not a whole lot on here. So I'm gonna go ahead and add up the ones that I have not pulled yet. And those total $46. 20, 45, and 6, 46. And we're going to go ahead and call this another completed game. Let's take this out, put this back in. Let's count this up 150, 70, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 198. Did not know that much was in there. Oh my gosh, you guys. Another 198. I'm just going to go ahead and put that in there. And that's another Busy Bee card. Let's play the new game. This is called Honey Pot Savings. April just finished this one, I think, last, I don't know, a few days ago. And she sent it to me, so... Let's see what we've got. Color one symbol and save $40 every week. Ooh, when completed, you have $2,080 in one year. This is pretty cool. Okay, so each one is worth 40. So we're gonna put that to the side. I'm gonna go ahead and color in one of the flowers. Okay, Honey Pot Savings is officially started, and yeah, $2,080, that's quite a Honey Pot. I like this game. And when you order it from Etsy, you get three of these. First 40, and that is another Busy Bee card. Let's see what we've got. One, two, three. Okay, so these two are Honey Money for $3. And this one is all about your hair. So today I have, I always have extensions. That's a given. Those don't come out. Five. Those are sewn in my head. And I also have it in a kind of like a haphazard bun. Hmm. I'm going to go ahead and do the ponytail. It's kind of a ponytail for another two.
Okay, you guys, when I clear the table off, you know it is now time for everybody's favorite, Hello Honey. This is a freebie. We play this together every Sunday. It's a different game that I have for you guys, which makes it so much fun for me and you. Click below if you have not started Hello Honey with us, and let's get going. Today's version is called You Are Trippin', and here's what we're going to do. We're going to see if you can name a city by looking at a photo. Of course, I'm going to put that photo right here in the center of the camera. And as always, we will have easy, medium, and hard. Go get your paper and pen. Okay, you guys, let's get started. We're going to start with those easy ones. Can you name these five cities? Each one is worth $1. These are all U.S. cities, and here we go. And number two. Next. I think we all know this one. And we probably all know this one. Okay, so let's get to the mid-level cities. These are around the world, not just the US. And these are gonna be worth $2 a piece. Here we go. The first one. And where is this? How about this city? Number four. And one of my favorites, number five. Okay, that was the mid-level. Now we're gonna get to the harder ones. Now these harder ones are not in the US and they're worth $3 a piece. Here we go. Number one. Number two. Where do you think this is? Do you know this one? And the last one. Okay, you guys, those were our three levels. Easy, medium, and hard, worth one, two, and three dollars a piece. You can add those up and you can quit now or you can do the bonus round. This one is going to be three US states, not cities, states. You can make them worth whatever you want, a quarter a piece, a dollar a piece, $20 a piece, whatever fits in your budget and let you play the bonus round with us. Okay, so I'm gonna show you three photos and let's see if you can name the state. Here we go. What U.S. state is that? And here's number two. Okay, and the last one. Okay, you guys, let's see how you did. Let's get the answers. For the easy level, we had San Francisco. Philadelphia, Nashville, New York City, and Washington, D.C. Mid-level answers are Los Angeles, Paris, Sydney, Rome, Miami, and the hard ones. See how you did on these. We've got London, Bangkok. Rio de Janeiro, Dubai, and Singapore. Okay, the bonus round answers. We've got Hawaii, Texas, and of course, Florida. 
Yay. All right, you guys, add up all of those answers. Put them in the comments and let me know what you saved. I'm gonna average them up and that will help me with what I'm gonna save on this honey pot. I did not have a chance to add up your answers from last week, so I've got these two I need to do based on your answers. That definitely counts as a game. Vitamin B, based on the sun chart. Okay, today it is 92 degrees, so that is four dollars. Okay, I think I wanna play Gnome Match. This one, just like the name says, is a match game. I've only gotten to play this once and I love it. Okay, so we have these little cards and there's six matches. Let's mix these up. Let's see if I, if I can do as good as I did last time. I did really good last time I played. I shocked myself. And it's a little hard to do with these nails, but. All right, let's see how I do. Okay, so we've got a, we've got a little gumdrop and the ring pop. Got some gummy bears. Oh, and the ring pop. So I already know that's three bucks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm gonna cash those ones out. Okay, so we're up to three bucks. Oh my gosh, I hope I didn't forget <laughs> the ones I turned taking so long. Okay, so we've got regular candy and the lollipop. Okay. Okay, we've got the gumdrops. I think those were over here. Yes, and that is save any amount. Let's go with five. Ooh, the gumball machine and the lollipop. Okay. I think the lollipop was here. Yes. Yes. Okay. So this one is roll the dice and save that amount. You guys know me. I got to roll more than one. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay. So we've got 11. $11 on that one. Uh, did I pull this one yet? Ooh, the candy. Where was that? Uh, was it this one? Yes. Oh my gosh. I can't believe I got that. A dollar. And this one? Ooh, maybe it's this one? No. Okay, of course. That would be too easy, right? Okay, so here we go. We've got the gumball machine. I can't believe I did it, you guys. 10. I play this and I get so nervous. Like, am I going to make a fool out of myself on YouTube? Because <laughs> I can't figure out a match game. And another five. But I did it. Yay. All right, let's see. Gnome match. 10, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35 dollars. Okay, so let's see how much gnome matches up to. 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 63. Let's pull one of these cards. You bet your B. Bet any amount you wish and choose a number one to six. Roll the dice. If you roll your number, save your bet, whatever, whatever you want. If you lose, place your bet in the savings. Okay, so I'm gonna say that I'm gonna roll a four. No, I got a three. So that means I have to put $4 into my emergency fund. There's four. A 
let's see what I have left. And we are going to put this into my 100 envelope challenge. So I have 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88 dollars. And the 88 is open. Perfect. 88. That's a pretty one. I like this envelope. I kind of like to cash this out. I don't like putting so much into this. Okay, so here's 50. That helps. And believe me guys, I've not forgotten about my 20K pot of gold. It is up to $7,040. I just have not had the extra cash to put in this for the last few weeks with my dental appointments and all of the crazy stuff that's been going on. But I did not forget about this and it will be back on next week. The Busy Bee cards have added 10, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33 dollars. I want to tell you guys about a friend that I have made here on YouTube. Her name is Faithy. Her name is actually Faith, but she likes to be called Faithy. And her and her mom have started a cash stuffing YouTube channel. And Faithy is doing her own videos with her own binders. And I think that is so awesome. So I want to show her some support. Here is their channel, The Still Trying Mama. And you guys, they are doing a great job. Go over to Faithy's channel and show that little lady some love. Hi, Faithy. Okay, so who is not a subby? Yes, I'm talking to you. It is time. Hit that button. Be part of the hive. Get us this much closer to that 10K so we can have that exciting giveaway. I cannot wait to give this stuff to you guys. And if you missed my cash stuffing video the other day, Click right here and keep watching Two Sister Bees.